Endeavour Hills Specialist School, we're a school for students with intellectual disability or um, autism with a complex language disorder. Uh, we've been open since, uh, I guess, the beginning of January, so very, very new. Um, obviously, still trying to get to know all the students, get to know the staff, um, but you know, it's a really fantastic place to work. I think it's it's the students. You know, the students are they're they're fantastic. They're just you know a delight to work with. Um, they've all you know got such wonderful personalities and such individual um, quirks, I guess. Yeah. Um, and just to see their resilience and how they've gone with starting at a brand new school, brand new staff, um, new friends, new everything. You know, they, they, they're just amazing the way that they've um, settled in and, and are trying their best every day. Each building has its own art room um, and music room within the, the building. So the school is set up in a series of separate buildings. Um, each, each building has a name of a native plant. So at the moment we're using peppermint and banksia. Um, yeah, within those buildings they have your art room, music room, um, the older buildings um, have um, a life skills building so the students are practicing those um, practicals, life skills, cooking, making a bed, um, you know, developing a menu, making their own lunch, um, those sort of things. We have our community centre which is absolutely wonderful. Uh, that uh, is for the community as well. So there's a full-size competition basketball court, there's a performing arts centre, there's a, a commercial grade kitchen in there for the students to learn those hospitality skills. And that's also for the community to come in. So local basketball groups, etc. Local primary schools are wanting to use the facilities as well. So we'll be doing that, but our students will be part of those activities. So they'll be coming in to use them, but our students you know, might join their local, um, their sports day or something like that to, to have that sort of integration into the community as well. I mean on the surface when you look at it, you know, brand new facilities, yeah. that is rather lovely and having all these fancy facilities yeah. but um, I think just the opportunity to shape the direction of a school from the ground up, that's not an opportunity that you get very often um, and you know we are building from the ground up so taking on people's interests and skills and expertise and building you know, a fantastic school for our, for our community.